Hey everyone, so this morning I went to the pet store that my brother works at. Uh, I get 50% off of all fish, so it's really sweet. Uh, I had plans to buy a bunch of live plants as well. So I usually have a, I think it's like a 55 gallon tank just crazy full of live plants. Of course today they had absolutely no live plants there. Uh, except for like uh, uh, frog tanks and stuff like that. Like poison dart frog tanks. Uh, so I was not able to buy any live plants. Uh, so whenever they get them back in, I'll have to go back for that. Uh, I meant to spend maybe a half hour there. Instead, I spent well over an hour looking at all the different fish, thinking about what to do with this tank. Uh, so what I did is I, I brought back my little rasboras. I had near tetras. I'm still not sure what they were. I think they were lamp lampi tetras. Uh, so I brought them back because they're just super tiny. And then I went ahead and I decided to buy six of these Australian rainbow fish. These guys will get somewhere around four inches. So right now they're probably in between two to three inches. And I bought six of them. And then I bought six of the gold barbs. They had some full size ones there. These are almost full grown. Uh, they'll, they'll get a little bit longer and a little bit stockier. Uh, so I also bought six of them. Uh, both the golden barbs and the shrimp rainbows are peaceful fish. I Meaning they should get along okay with my beta, as long as the beta does not attack them. Uh, then same thing with the Pilates that are in here still. Uh, and then there is... There he is. Alright, so they are being acclimated at this moment. And uh, then when I go, to ha go ahead and put them in here, I will be back. All right, so we are going to put my new fish into my 45 gallon tank here. Uh, so the way I've been doing this is so it's a bit less stressful. I used to always just take the bag, bring it to my bathroom, which is right next door to my room here. Uh, empty most of the water out, run bag in here and throw them in there. Now I'm going to be using a net just in case, uh, a net and a bucket here. Uh, so I'm going to pretty much do the same thing as I did in the bathroom, just using a bucket. Uh, then that is for just in case they decide to slip through, uh, yeah, that way, you know, that way they're not in the bucket. Uh, first I'm going to do the rainbows, and yes, I do need added more water to this tank, especially after doing this. Uh, so I do have the six rainbows here, the water, and I will let them go free. Then there's six of those, and then this giant bag here, again, will be six gold barbs, golden barbs. I got one of the same exact thing. Uh, it's, you know, low my water level is now. And we'll release them in here. There we go. So that has a giant bag. Then, of course, sit here and make sure the beta doesn't attack them or they don't attack the beta. Uh, which they all just looked at the beta and were like, eh. No one cares about you. And I was like, eh, I don't care about you either. Alright, so yep, there they are. It's all together, the golden barbs. There's my beta just getting taken away by the current. Uh, and then there are the Ashura rainbows. So of course right now they're all going to be stressed. I mean, they've been in the bag for over an hour, uh, being acclimated. Um, my Pilates, well one of the places up there, the other ones are probably hiding in here. Uh, again, I do plan on redoing this tank once again. It's just I couldn't buy any live plants today because they didn't have any. Uh, and Peco and Pesima are just outrageous on their prices on that type of thing uh, for the most part. And again, I get half off on all fish and live plants from the pet store my brother works at. Uh, yeah, so we'll see here and we'll see what they do. Uh, so far, it looks, it looks like they'll be okay. Uh, yeah, so thank you guys, of course, as always, for watching. And... I'll see you guys in the next one. I hope you guys have a good day. Goodbye.